Okay, we're recording Packet Tracer and we will be examining the NAT on a multifunction device. Um, our first step to do this is to click the Link System device to access the configuration window. Okay. Next, we will access the Link System GUI menu, which is up here. Tab. Okay, click the Status menu option in the upper right hand corner. It is the last, yeah, we got found it. Once selected, this router to this defaults the router or defaults to the router page. Click local network. Oh, okay, it's a blue button. That'd be this one here. Uh, scroll down to the local network information. Step three, connect four PCs to the link device. Okay, you can do that one. Okay, there's four of them. I use straight through cable. I use the eth Ethernet fast part. And should be good enough. And we'll go for the one. I'm gonna make sure everything's green. You don't before you go on, you may make sure both ends are green. So we'll wait here until they turn green. Oh, there goes one. Just click. And then we go to config. Ethernet. And then we click DHCP. And then it automatically does it for you. I can do that to each computer. Okay, uh, check the IP configuration of each uh, command prompt, and then we will type in IP con, oops, put it in there, config, Just gave me the one for that one. Device will show received a private address. Private address are not available to cross the internet. Therefore, NAT transition must occur. 
close PC configuration window. Step four, view NAT transmission translation across the link system. Enter simulation mode by clicking the corner. Okay. Going to in there. Now we will go down to View the traffic by creating a complex PDU simulation mode. From the simulation panel, select the edit filters and check only TCP and HTTP. And it's not working. For some odd reason, stopped responding. Yes, it stopped responding. Don't know what's wrong. There it goes. So we want the TCP. Oh, we'll just click this over here for so deselect them all. And then we want TCP. Then we want HTTP. I'm guessing it's that one, not the one with the S, just without the S. And you just off click it and it'll pop up there. Add a complex PDU by clicking the open envelope located above the simulation mode icon. Click one of the PCs, it asks as the source, Pacif specifically the complex PDU setting will settings by changing the following items within the create complex PDU window. I guess I'll close this. I'll set this aside for now. Oh, I'm me to. Doesn't look like it. Let's close it for now. Uh oh. Okay. Let's set it aside. So I guess we go into here and we click on one of the PCs and it pops up this bar. <clears throat> Under the BU settings, select application should be set to HTTP. So I want to change from ping. HTTP click the Cisco Cisco learn dot net dot com wherever that's supposed to be server to specialize its destination oh okay so we have to put it in there click the it says click the. Well, where is 